<laughs> Viva la vegan! Hi, I'm Lee Chantel from vivalavegan.net and welcome to this vlog of mine. And this is for February. I hope you've had a really great start to 2015 so far. I know that I have and I know that I've been really, really busy, even more so than normal. So I hope you've had a good one. I hope you've been catching up with all the interviews that I've done. Um, you might have seen my interview that I did with Nick Pendergrass who is from Progressive Podcast and quite a few other groups in Perth in Western Australia and um, he also interviewed me. So you can have a look at progressivepodcastaustralia.com for our interview and I talk about a lot of things including the evils of Facebook and communicating properly online. and many many other things also you might have seen that my podcast that I've been doing with my friend Chris Jackson um, we've had about three now so it's the CJ and LC podcast the first one we did was just Chris and I chatting together and talking about various things including Japan where he lives at the moment with his partner and their daughter um, number two was with a fan of mine, Corey Levitan, and um, he writes for Men's Health and we talked about where he lives in Las Vegas and many other things. Um, and then just recently, my friend Jeremy, who is, was the one who suggested that Chris and I do this podcast, he just came home from a five-week cycling trip in um, New Zealand. So we did a podcast with him just recently and that's been uploaded. So make sure you see those there's a YouTube playlist of the CJ and LC podcasts and you can also listen to the audio on Podomatic, Stitcher, Scatter Radio, iTunes etc. Hope you really like them. If you'd like to be interviewed on the show please let me know because I'm always looking for new people to interview. You may also have seen that um, all of my ebooks that I've written from my detox diet to the recipe books to my What Do Vegans Eat book, all the ebooks are on about half price sale at the moment through Living Social. So there's deals starting from $5 for the ebooks. So make sure you um, share that to your non vegan friends, and that'll be going until I think about mid March. So hopefully, you can get some good deals there. Also make sure you check out my stuff on Patreon and um, support me if you can in a monetary way. I've got many new videos that I've been working on at the moment. Some I've been filming with um, Cam and um, Cameron has a channel called um, Cam on Fruit on YouTube so you can check that one out as well and the first one that we did was how to make homemade coconut yogurt and I only used two ingredients you can see that on YouTube and you can also have a look at vivalavegan.net for the recipe as well and we have many many other videos that we've been that we've shot already and the next one to come is the chia pudding so make sure you um, have a look out for that that's I'm sure a lot of you know that's one of my favorite things to eat so I'm very excited to share that one with you I've been catching up with a lot of friends from interstate from locally and overseas had a really good time down at the Gold Coast at Surfers Paradise catching up with my friend Seth Tibbet you may know him as the founder of Tofurky and Turtle Island products so he's here in um, Melbourne at the moment and he'll be going home soon so that was really cool to hang out with him and um, I did a photo shoot with my friend Carol Slater and hopefully you know that name because she does the majority of my photographs and and she was also the photographer for my There's a Vegan in the Kitchen book that was released last year. We did a photo shoot at our local Loving Hut restaurant which is in Mount Gravatt here in Brisbane. She was um, taking photographs of all the food for the menu to spruce up their, their menu photos and also quite a few posing photos with myself and some other friends. Today I'm off to an event for Food Connect and it's their 10th or 20th anniversary so that's a pretty cool thing going along there and um, I'm really looking forward to seeing my friend Chris who did the documentary Lucent and we're doing some screenings with some good friends Renata and Mo from Vegans in Toowoomba um, they're organizing a couple of events for him to speak at and to screen at the documentary um, Toowoomba 
will be on Thursday night and then Friday night in Dolby and we're also um, going to be at the Farm Animal Rescue Sanctuary at Debra here in Brisbane on the Saturday so if you're in any of those areas I'd really love to see you so make sure you come along and you can also check out my website for the interview and the podcast that I did with Chris last year all about his documentary and you can have a look at his websites to check out the documentary if you haven't seen it already. There's some really exciting news coming up for Viva La Vegan in the next month or so so make sure you keep your ear peeled for that. I've also been busy with various projects and work projects and I'm looking forward to putting a few of my ebooks and books out in this year and in the near future. So a couple of bands recently too, um, a few of my favourites which has been really cool. Um, 1975, a great band from Manchester and um, I saw them at the marquee at the RNA showgrounds here in Brisbane. I also saw Jamie Hutchings who is from one of my favourite um, Australian bands of all time, Blue Bottle Kiss, and he did his own solo show. He played at a place called the Junk Bar and I'd never been there before so that was good to see him there. And um, my sister and I just recently went to see a Manchester electronic duo called Lamb and um, so that's who I've seen lately and I'm looking forward to seeing some new bands and seeing some new things in the few months in the next months to come so I'd love to hear what you've been up to make sure that you subscribe to this channel if you have not already and make sure you join us across all our social media channels Facebook Twitter YouTube Google Plus Pinterest etc so um, if you have any comments if you have any questions if you have anything you'd like me to do in the future in regards to interviews and videos please let me know. Have a really great March and I look forward to seeing you soon. Take care.